Alright guys, welcome back to Keymash Appeal and we are once again going through Sonic Adventure DX. We're on Sonic Story right now, if you didn't notice from just by looking at the screen. Last time we left off, we did the first three stages, did a couple of character bios, and ended off at the fourth stage, which is Ice Cap. So, let's do Ice Cap. Okay, Ice Cap. I hate this level so much. I just I, the level is cool and all, but I just never found a love for it. Now, there's just sometimes that you just have levels that you're like, yeah, you know, this level's awesome, this level's really cool, and... No. This level and me never clicked. We never went on a date. I never had to pay for it. It just fails. So, we're doing a little speed running technique if I can land. Yeah, what we just did. Speed run. Let's go. <laughs> That's what I'll do for my speed run. Um, for here, there's two ways you can do it. You can do a glitch. Uh, I'm probably going to try to do the glitch for the actual speed run, or you can just dash. No! Don't hit the invisible wall. No! Uh, let's restart, because I don't like going through this area too either. Or you can jump over. Stop hitting stuff. Or you can just jump all the way over here, like that. Hit that button, and we're base. We're done for the most part of this area what to do next is the switches oh, hit the jumps. and yeah now one section left snowboard and go yes you get the snowboard in the ice cap zone kinda reflection of Sonic 3 don't you think alright now this actually does have pretty cool music for an ice for this ice cap this um, little segment here, so I rather enjoy that. Just turn it. Now if you do know where the rings are, that is the quickest way to get through the ice cap zone. In that first part at least. Okay, now we actually can see where we're going. Now rule of thumb if you're trying to do this fast is avoid any small jumps. That will make this run go a lot smoother for you. Alright. Now, yes, there are some jumps that are un unavoidable, but do your best to avoid them. Alright, stay down here. Take the jump. Awesome. Stay in the lower path and follow the trail of rings for the most part. Now, you notice how you do the little trick at the end of the jump? If you see on the jump how there's a red there's like the checkered path and there's a small area that has the red stripes on it go for the red stripes if you push the jump button right when you get there you'll do a trick the faster you go when you launch off of it the faster uh, the farther you'll go with the trick so you want as much speed as you can when you go through it okay I'm gonna slide over down here Jump. And trick. Now there is a way to bust out a different trick there. I've never really been able to do it. I don't know. This I don't I don't know what I'm doing wrong there, but there's just something I'm always keeping doing wrong at that point. Because you actually can from that jump launch all the way to the end. That's like this level is one of the levels I'm really gonna have to work on for my speed run to make it really clean and really good. Yeah, not bad. Most of the other levels I can do really well already. But there's just some like that one that I'm gonna have to redo. Alright. Oops. Let me jump in there. Uh, we can just <laughs> boost up the wall there though. Alright, so now we're gonna head back down. After running on the ceiling. Oh and head over here and touch scene. Oh, look who it is. What's up, Knuckles? What's up, Knuckles? Something bugging you? Must be. No time for game, Sonic. Give me the emeralds you have right now. Knuckles is not happy. What? Let's just see you take them. Huh. Okay. Time for another boss battle. First thing you start off oh, no. is roll at him. Do it again. Oh, no. And oh, do it again. No. That's it. Uh, oh. oh no! 
the Chaos Emeralds. Great, both of them we just acquired too. Like taking candy from a baby! Thanks, Knuckles. Look what you did! That's a Chaos Emerald! No, duh! That's right, fool! You made it all too easy! You practically gave me a cake! Hold it right there, creep! You can't get away with this! He just Knuckles, did, Sonic! Don't tell me Eggman tricked you again! <laughs> me? Yes. How about you? Yes, you did! Way to go, Knucklehead! Ah, uh, no, Knucklehead, as the name's Knuckles, I have not so far. Chaos! Now, at this point in time, do you have to remember that Chaos already had two emeralds? So yes, he did transform again, so that's what he looks like with two. You, now we get to see Chaos 4. And not just see, we get to battle Chaos 4. Oh, he transformed again! Man! No one ever cuts us any slack. Uh, Chaos 4. Great. Now, Chaos 3 is actually never seen, so we have no clue what Chaos 3 looks like at all. Now, the funny thing about this is that you actually can stand on the water. Yes, you might think you have to stand on the lay pads. Nope. You can just stand flat out on the water. See? Now, all it does is make you walk slower. But still. It just makes life a lot easy. Whoa! Hey there, buddy! Don't you be trying to smack me around. I'll show you a thing or two. Now, just like the chaos before, all we're gonna do is need a homie attack him, I believe, five times for him to die. Whoa, jump! Ow! You jerk. Did I miss all those coins? Yes, I did. And I think I used... Nope. There's one panel left. Now, I know in uh, a later boss that if you actually charge up the light speed dash, when you hit the boss, it does more damage. I have no clue about this form of chaos. But we're gonna find out. Oh, that's right. We don't... Mm, I just spoiled something. Oh, well. We don't have the correct move to do that yet. <laughs> but that was kind of cool doing like to be dashing to chaos. And now he's gonna be good balls. Stop it! Stop throwing your balls at us. Oh, stop it, chaos! Whoa, crap! Okay. What did I get hit by? Uh, I didn't even get hit by anything. When chaos sticks his head oh, head shut up! Alright, I'm gonna speed this up because this boss fight takes a while and that was stupid. I didn't even get hit and I died. Whoa, whoa. See you guys back after I beat this. Alright, so we finally finished off Chaos. Now one thing I forgot to mention about that boss battle is you only can hit Chaos when he fully comes up from the water. But when he normally attacks when he's above the water, it doesn't matter. He has to be fully, himself has to be fully above the water for anything to happen. And now we have to actually rather good looking cutscene. I just realized something.
Hopefully I can pull something off to kid that Behold away. my floating masterpiece, the egg carrier! But it fails in comparison to the power of chaos! Adieu! Until we meet again, my friends! <laughs> We can't let him get away! Let's get to my workshop and we'll take the tornado! Yeah! You guys go. I have some unfinished business to take care of. Yeah, they're screwing that no to problem, totally Knuckles. Knuckles. We'll take care of everything here. Come on! Let's get going! Alright, now we can officially play with Knuckles. FYI, what we're about to do really sucks really badly sucks and don't forget since my cursor was on the screen like for the whole uh, first 11 minutes that I am playing a PC game on this okay well I'll get to what we're doing first and then I'll explain what I'm gonna do about it Sonic, wait here for a second We're waiting. Eh? I like Tails' theme. And tornado power go. And those wheels weren't moving at all. And he says hop in, but we get on top of it. We don't really hop Let's in go. it. Okay. Sub game. Yes. This is really annoying. So, what I'm going to do is explain, whoa, explain what you can do in this sub game. And then I'm going to fast forward because I don't really know if you guys really want to watch me doing this all the whole time. Okay, so first you have the normal, you can fly around. Then you can do a normal attack. Yeah, it's really not that smart to do the normal attack for one reason. One reason alone. It kind of sucks. It's really hard to hit things with. So what you really want to do is hold down the attack button. And you actually can do what I've been doing like this whole time. Which is locking onto the enemies. So that's what you want to try to do. You want to use the lock on to lock onto the enemies. And you can lock onto a lot. I don't know exactly the number count that you can lock onto. But it is a buttload. Now be aware that this game does like to like pull the nasty tricks on you just like Sega does. So right before you come down, be aware that they're gonna shoot rockets at you. But luckily for us, we dodged them all and took care of the enemies. Now it's gonna happen again, so be aware. Let's see how many we can these things we can take out. The more the better because we don't have to deal with them later. Alright, so, as I said, we're gonna fast forward. See you guys back when we're done. As a camera, Woo! Woo! We did it! All right, so we're officially go, done. Bro. This one's not as long as the, the second one. Yes, there's another one. And did we dodge it? Did we dodge it? Did we dodge it? No, we fail. And 80%. Not bad. Now, I've never got 100%, so I'm not going to do this until I get 100%. That would be crazy. And we conveniently fall in the sand. Tails? Tails? You are not Tails. 
You're not who I'm looking for. Anyway. Oh, I wonder if he's okay. As Sonic acts like a parent to Tails, we have to go do something else, which is go in the casino area. New character. Long time no see. Uh, uh, Amy. Just like Sonic, I What's really don't want to be around anyway? Amy. Listen, this birdie seems to be in trouble, so you need to be in That bird's foot is definitely going through your hand. You must be kidding. If you don't, we're just gonna tag along anyway. I guess we better do what she says. Now it doesn't tell you at all what to do in this. But what we have to do is head back into the main area of Station Square. No, stop, stop it, stop it! No, stop it! Okay. And we're gonna head over here to a little place called Twinkle Park. No problem! He's just a chunk of cheesy hardware! Whoa! Oh, now what? Huh? Don't... don't go in there! It says, Shoot, couples, get in free. Let's go. Okay, where did it say that? I didn't see it say that wait, at all! Wait, uh, wait, 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 wait! Oh, man! Now, what happened to the robot? That girl is where'd it go? Like, really, where did it go? It was coming at us. It wasn't that far away from us. The way it was moving, it would have been to us before Amy even read this. No, not before Amy read this. And before she walked in there, it would have been at us. But, uh, we're at Twinkle Park. Oh, gosh. This place is beyond annoying. No. Like that. I hate this place so much. Uh, let's hurry up and get out of here as quickly as we can. Okay, Twinkle Park. So we get a little cart section here. Now, just so you know, if you when you're doing the turns, if you not if you end up not being able to make the turn, you want to try as much as you can to uh, uh, try as much as you can. You want to let go of the gas, which is jump. Weirdly, if you let go of the gas button, you actually will be able to take sharper turns. If you see how I'm doing that. How did that hit me? No. What? Freaking stupid cards. Ah! Don't you dare. As you can tell, I desperately do not like this part. No. Ah! Stop following me. I do not have your lucky charms. Stop it! Okay. I'm getting back into this. Now the thing is, when you do do that though, you want to make sure you don't completely just let go of the gas for too. Oh my god, stupid monkey! For too. Oh, if I didn't make that, I would have been pissed. For too long. If you do it for too long, it will actually slow. Uh, make you go slower than you actually do. So you want to do it kind of let go of gas, put back gas back on, let go of gas, put gas back on. Now when you hit the ramps, I mean the speed boosters, this, you don't... If I didn't get that coin and he, hit me, and he hits me again and makes me lose all my coins, I'm gonna be pissed. Now when you hit the speed boosters, it will automatically launch you straight. So, if when you're on a turn and it has had an angle, you don't have to worry about it launching you off. Alright, so I missed all those coin capsules. And we hit a rock! Then you we should have. And... Okay. Now, I've seen something pulled off here that I have never tried yet. So this is going to be a first time me trying this on camera. If you jump down it, you can actually miss the next part completely and skip to the end instantly. I want to see if I can pull this off. Nope. Failed. Will it start me at the beginning of this? Oh, I can't do it. Darn it. But what's supposed to happen is if you do it fast enough, when I mean, you're jumping down, you can actually do the homie attack and pass this roller coaster, and you'll land. Like, you'll just flat land on the track. If you do this, you actually can skip the whole level. 
So this is something I'm going to work on so that for my my actual speed run of it, I will have it done. Okay. And just quickly go through that. Don't care. I can't see. Uh, glitch through a wall. <laughs> Whatever. Ah, it's all fun stuff in the end, isn't it? I love being able to skip things. Camera, notice where we are. Thank you. <coughs> oh, oh, oh. That sucks. Luckily, we can just do that again. Oh, uh, no. Bad. I want to skip level. I want to skip level. Why does it let me do it now? I pulled it off the first time. There we go. Or almost at it. Now oh, screw this. There's probably an easy way that doesn't involve me screwing up like that. Aha! Thank you, ramps. Okay, normally you're supposed to homing attack to the rings there. I don't know why it didn't work. I never tried something here. There's a ramp here. Can I? I can! <laughs> that makes me skip a lot of stuff. You know why? Because we're at the end of the level. So even with all the failure, we still bust the level out in three minutes. Not bad. Oh, three and a half minutes, sorry. That's not bad. Monkey, stop throwing stuff at us. You can't hurt us. Stop it. What the heck is that thing? Slowly getting closer. 